What a stomp. Good grief. Boom, oh, what impact. This is not where Kalisto wants to be. These two superstars are set to lock up for their respective teams Ugh. as this six-man tag gets underway. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Oh, got the shoulders down. Plenty of fight left. That's either sheer genius or complete stupidity, Cole. Inziguri. Great shoulders on the mat. That wasn't even close to three. It's going to take more than that. This might be it. Oh, my. Beautiful technique. Woo wee. Kalisto in a bad way here. I think it's safe to say that the action so far in this six-man tag team match is exactly wow. what we expected. You know, there's an art to being a successful tag team competitor. And right now, he oh, resembles man. more of a finger pain. You never want to count a competitor out, yeah. but things don't seem to be going in his favor here tonight. Ooh, what impact. When a superstar is in a six-man match, one of the most important things to remember is knowing when to tag out and get the fresh member of your team in the ring. We've talked about continuity many times on this program, but it's more than that. You don't want to try to do too much when you have other members of your team out there. Thunderous slam. Boom! <laughs> Luke Gallows is in position. Shoot, Bob! Here's his moment, Michael. That is a huge opportunity for Luke Gallows. Corey, you spoke about one of superstars in six-man action and how crucial it is that they have the presence of mind to realize when they need to tag out. Not everyone who competes as part of a six-man team has the ability to do that. We've seen many times over the years that a superstar's inability to do that has cost their team the match. We've also seen over the years that not all superstars play well with others. Some competitors are so dedicated to singles careers that when they are put in a six-man team, they become a bit lost. That's when a mistake could be made, and it could be very costly. Ooh! Ooh-wee! Oh, Neckbreaker! Oh, oh. What a stomp! Good grief! Boom! Oh, what impact! This is not where Kalisto wants to be right now. It is looking real bad for Kalisto. Oh, right to the jaw! Here he goes. He looks for it once again. Oh, nasty impact. Oh, look at it. Uh-oh, crucifix. Crucifix. The shoulders are down. That was nowhere near a three count. Yeah, this early, no chance. He might have it. Big slam. I'm not sure how much he has left. We've got a cover. And a kick out. Not even close on that. Still plenty of ammo left in this machine gun. Nailed it. Oh my. Ooh, reverse STO. Harsh impact. Boom. Rocket kick. I think. Boom. Rocket kick. But he's got to capitalize now. Really working over the body. You got to believe this one's over. In comes AJ Styles. There it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Into the powerbomb position now. And that's not necessarily where you want to be at this point in the match. The magic killer from Luke Gallows proves that when you have the power and know how to punish an opponent, 
All it takes is one maneuver to put that opponent out. Just take a look at all the superstars who have fallen at the hands of Luke Gallows and the Magic Killer. Some superstars have said that even though they return to action, they know they'll never be the same. Boom, what impact! Kalisto showing some quickness. Beautiful. It's common knowledge that a smaller superstar like Kalisto should be no match for some of the giants in WWE. Should being the operative word there, Michael. We've seen Kalisto defeat big men before who should have beat him. Ugh. Miles looks like he wants to do it all by himself. Styles, Styles rolls through. Nailed it. Game, set, match. This one is over. Byron mentioned how Kalisto has wins over some of WWE's largest men, and that fact puzzles me. Simple physics tells us that Kalisto should be an easy W for the mammoths of WWE. Well, it seems like Kalisto doesn't follow the rules of physics, Corey. You gotta believe this one's over. Carl Anderson tags in. Look at this. Showing off some of his speed there. Over time, there have been various types of six-man teams that have been successful. There are family trios like the Guerreros, the Grams, the Andersons, and the Von Erichs. And boom! With the cutter. This one's over, guys. This might be it. Oh, my. We know it. Boom. Super kick. Can he finish the job? Carl Anderson. There's a pin now. Byron, you mentioned some families and groups that created incredible six-man teams. Talking more about factions. Don't forget about the likes of the Hart Foundation, Evolution, the Wyatt Family, the Shield, and the New Day. These are only some of the trios who had unbelievable matches against a variety of adversaries. If we're talking about three-man teams, I need to shout out one of the baddest trios of all time who held the World Six-Man Championship on a number of occasions. I'm talking about the American Dream, Dusty Rowe. He's got him covered, and there's a kick out at one. Way too early. Ooh, that hurt. What a sharp one right to the cheekbone. AJ Styles losing some grip here. Styles has to get Oof. it together. And you know all three of the superstars he's up against won't back down at any point during this match. When you put that much meat oh. in the ring, somebody's going to get hurt. And unfortunately for him, he's the one on the receiving end of this inevitable beatdown. This is all part of the process, guys. He knew he would take on some offense here tonight. He just has to make sure he keeps it to a minimum. I know Luke thinks this is a solid strategy, but I'm not so sure. In off the tag. Oh, Dials looks like he wants to do it all by himself. He's on the defensive now. He needs to find a way to get on the offensive, guys. I'm not at all surprised. Byron Calf Crusher's in. Cinched in. Nowhere to go. You have to like his chances here. Pops him up. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, my God. He's in position. Styles clash. This one is over. What an amazing six-man tag match. Now let's get another look at those six superstars going head-to-head -to -head and toe-to-toe. -to -toe. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. A very impressive victory. This was all about one competitor's refusal to lose. When you see that, you have no choice but to respect it. And what an amazing threesome they make.